I started out my climbing career in this very rigid, focused way. It was all about training and results and competition. I was so focused on being the best and being competitive that I couldn't really see past that. That definitely burned me out. I see myself transitioning into more of an all-around mountain athlete. Here in Tahoe, everyone kind of does everything and that's how everyone stays motivated. The allure of going out and having a good time with friends is always there, so I just keep saying yes because it's so much fun and it's really hard to say no. I can run or I can ski or I can go climb a big wall and have a massive day because that's what my training is focused on. I play outside all the time. I hang out with mostly people who are really fun loving and even though they might be in their mid 30s, they act like they're 12. I love having fun and I like goofing off and I think over the years I've become more comfortable just being myself when I'm acting totally ridiculous or when I'm singing a song or dancing or whatever it may be. Sport climbing is my favorite style of climbing. It's so mellow and easy just to go out with your friends and clip bolts and climb beautiful routes and feel that movement. I love practicing whatever medium makes sense for the season. When it gets really hard, I start to think about all the things that I want to achieve and how difficult those things are going to be and how much better off I will be in those moments if I get through this day. I wanted to go to places around the world and experience beautiful places. I discovered this love for going out and getting crushed in the big mountains. Combining those two things, the biggest mountains in the world, with this ski objective was terrifying, but also incredibly exhilarating and motivating for me. I will have some sort of structure to my training. I may go backcountry skiing with my friend. Maybe I'll try to push myself on the way up and be breathing really hard. But then I get to ski really good snow all the way down and have a blast. I think I nailed it. <laughs> Big wall free climbing, it's this really amazing combination of having an adventure, getting crushed, climbing all day, being totally wrecked, and technical, difficult rock climbing. It's like the perfect combination. I used to think that the end all be all was competition climbing and training all the time. I just had this very narrow focus of what it meant to be a climber. And that's something I think back on and I'm like, wow, I've changed so much. I don't think training has to be this super structured, calorie counting, like miserable thing that you just wake up in the morning and you like dread it and all you wanna do is have it be over with. I've completely structured my life around playing outside. It's just what I do and it's not what I force myself to do.